It's pretty straightforward to get your whole organization up and running on Parsec for Teams. Set up some computers, either in the office or in the cloud, invite the appropriate users, and allow them to securely connect to them anywhere, anytime. But for many Parsec for Teams admins, setup is just the beginning. Monitoring and segregating traffic, guaranteeing performance and reliability, and having visibility of Parsec connections is just as important as having that control in the office. And that's why we created the Parsec High Performance Relay, an enterprise add-on to Parsec for Teams. The Parsec High Performance Relay lets you route all Parsec traffic through a single on-premises IP address, allowing you to centralize and monitor Parsec traffic in your organization, control bandwidth, optimize performance, as well as solve issues related to strict firewall or NAT settings and inconsistent connectivity from people's homes. In this video, we're going to have a look at how the Relay server works, how to set it up, and a couple other applications that might be useful. By default, Parsec connects clients and hosts directly to one another using STUN, Session Traversal Utilities for NAT, and UPnP, Universal Plug and Play. For gamers, individuals, and small organizations, this kind of security is typically more than enough. Parsec for Teams opens up the ability to use VPN tunneling as an alternative, but that can come with a dip in performance, quality, and added latency. Why add more time to such a fast thing? For most large organization and enterprise environments, the Parsec Relay gives you all the security benefits and control you might find in a VPN, but is built to be just as performant, and sometimes even more so, than our standard connections. You can relay many simultaneous Parsec connections through a single IP. It can be used for both large on-prem deployments or public clouds, and is particularly handy when your workstations do not have direct internet access. Let's have a look at how to deploy and set up the Parsec Relay server for your organization's network. The first thing to know is that in order to use the Parsec Relay server on your network, you'll need to provision a virtual or physical server that has at least two cores, four gigabytes of RAM, a one gigabit or faster network interface card, and be running any of the following operating systems. In your enterprise firewall, configure the server with a public IP via static NAT. Once ready, you can access the Gateway Server install URL from the Parsec for Teams configuration page. If you haven't purchased the Gateway Server add-on for your Parsec for Teams account, you'll be prompted to do so before you can access this URL. Once you've copied the URL, connect to the machine and download and extract the tarball. Then, copy the parsec hpr file to the slash bin directory and parsec hpr.service file to etc slash systemd slash system directory. Next, open the slash etc slash systemd slash system slash parsec hpr.service file in your favorite text editor and modify it to specify the public IP address public port, and internal port, and then save the file. Finally, run the service with the sudo systemctl start parsec hpr and sudo systemctl enable parsec hpr commands. The parsec relay should now be installed and running. You can check the status of the relay server by running the service parsec hpr status command. With the relay server installed, your team can now take full advantage of your on-premises internet connection. You can monitor traffic in and out of the gateway server and manage the security of your organization much more effectively than standard VPN tunneling or stun UPnP connections. One more cool thing, let's say you've got teams spread all over the world and you want different groups connecting to different offices via unique local gateways. Well, that's pretty easy. Simply head to Team Management, click on a group, and head to App Settings. Here, you'll find a section to set a specific gateway server for an individual group. 
If you're an organization with multiple team members working remotely, we highly recommend adding the Parsec Relay server to your Parsec for Teams account and deploying it onto your network, as it's the best way to support your team's performance and ensure the security of your connections. With Parsec High Performance Relay, international organizations working from anywhere in the world can connect into their local server all through Parsec. We think that's pretty sweet. For more information on using the Parsec High Performance Relay and Parsec for Teams, follow the link in the description below. Thanks for watching.